All right, guys, how's it going? KCV3 here with one uh, news article, um, you know, video today. Uh, it's pretty much um, Grand Theft Auto 5. Now, the release date has finally been revealed. It is indeed coming on November 18th. I think it was actually leaked on a website a couple weeks back, and now it's confirmed to come out November 18th. I think that was also the same day. Uh, I know Watch Dogs for the Wii U is coming out the same day, and I think it's the same day as Far Cry. Four comes out. I gotta check that again. Um, I haven't checked it yet, but um, yeah, um, it's coming out for the PS4 and the Xbox One, and it got delayed to come to the PC um, January 27th. Hasn't really been any news of why it got delayed. You know, pretty much, I guess, you know, need to be more worked on the, you know, on the PC systems and stuff. I think that's going to be the ultimate edition anyway, based off. What you can do with the PC, you know, all the mods you can do. I remember a lot of mods on Grand Theft Auto 4. Um, you know, it, it was, you know, it was ridiculous. It was pretty cool, but you know, it was, you know, crazy and ridiculous. It's based off, you know, what the machine, what the PC can do. So, you know, PC gamers can't play it till the 27th next year, of January. And uh, of course, with this is going to be, you know, graphical changes from the current generations from the um, Xbox 360 and the PS3, you know, to the PS4, to the uh, Xbox One. I think it's going to be 1080p, I'm not mistaken. Uh, I, I can't remember the frame rates or revolutions to it. So I'm just going to say 1080p, probably 60 frames per second, probably not. Uh, you know, some change, uh, there's uh, going to be new uh, vehicles and new cars and new, uh, you know, weapons in the game, additional weapons from, uh, you know, the current generation last year. And, um, you know, if you pre-order the game, there are bonuses, uh, like you get a million dollars in, in game credit to Grand Theft Auto, the single player and Grand Theft Auto Online. Uh, I don't even know if the heist DLC, you know, the heist, you know, the heist missions for online is available yet. I remember that's like one of the main big issues that, uh, you know, many people were having is this heist, uh, the heist missions were supposed to come in online since sometime this year. And it, you know, it's been delayed. It's been on hold. You know, I don't even know the status of it yet. So, um, yeah. So that's pretty much about it. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think about this game of news. Are you getting Grand Theft Auto 5 again if you played it on the PS3 or the Xbox 360 last year? Or, um, and if you getting it for PC, you know, will you, you know, get it when it comes on PC? I know there's a lot of gamers out there that, uh, you know, pretty much game on PC and on play on consoles. And you know they were actually very excited to get this game on uh, on PC, but you know they got to wait a little bit longer. But like I said, I think it's going to be a very ultimate addition for that part, based based on the stuff you can do on the PC than you can do on consoles. I'm not trying to bash or anything, but just you know based on the mods and stuff, that, you know bring back more uh, replay value to that alone. So yeah, so that's pretty much it. Um, thanks for watching, KP3, and as always. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys later on my next gaming videos.